While President Trump attracted those big crowds in Rio Rancho, our state's top Democrats held their own protest just a few miles south in Albuquerque, or make that a unity rally. Our Nathan O'Neill was there for it. He's back in our newsroom tonight. Nathan. Yeah, Tessa, while they may have been several miles away from where the president was actually speaking tonight, several of those Democratic leaders, they spoke out as if they were speaking directly to the president himself. How you doing, New Mexico? In a crowd of hundreds, Democrats united at Tiwi Park in Old Town, Albuquerque. Leaders do not personally attack women and people of color. Leaders do not make fun of the disabled. And leaders do not build walls that divide us. Party leaders spoke directly to President Trump as he campaigned 20 miles away in Rio Rancho. The president, he thinks he can win New Mexico. No, I don't think so. We went blue this last time, and hopefully we're going to continue to go blue. Congressman Ben Ray Lujan echoing that message, but still urging caution to voters. He's looking for extra states where he might find some electoral votes. We should take that seriously, though. And we need to understand the magnitude of this moment and come together and assure the country that New Mexico is not going to turn red, not under our watch, that we will deliver a Democratic president for the United States of America. And what we saw in Tiguay Park tonight was completely different than what we saw back in 2016 when the president visited Albuquerque. This protest remained peaceful and no incidents were reported. Back to you.